Protests in Brazil take a turn for the worse. Nearly one million indignant and angry demonstrators took to the streets throughout the country to demand a crackdown on corruption and wasteful government spending, which the protesters say are denying the wealthy nation of quality public services. The first fatality related to the demonstrations occurred on Thursday when a person was struck and killed by a car during a march in Sao Paulo. Authorities said police were given the go-ahead to use tear gas on a group of protesters who were trying to break into the Rio de Janeiro City Hall. Demonstrators also tried to overrun city offices in Fortaleza and other municipalities as well. The announcement that the government had decided not to raise the cost of public transport after all did little to cool tempers. Tens of thousands of people attending the Confederations Cup match between Spain and Tahiti in Maracana Stadium and the game between Uruguay and Nigeria in Salvador chanted anti-government slogans. The social tension pouring out into the streets of Brazil has forced President Dilma Rousseff to cancel a trip to Japan scheduled for next week as she desperately attempts to keep the protests from reaching a point of no return.